Hey everybody, I'm Captain Zeus and welcome back to BP Fun. In today's video, I have some DCU news that I just gotta go over with you guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe for more nerdy content just like this, and click the bell to be notified when we post more nerdy videos. Wah! Now, the Snyder has reported that Josh Brolin is the first choice in the current contender to be Hal Jordan in the upcoming HBO DCU series, Lanterns. And I hate that. I think Josh Brolin is a decent actor. I think he's good in certain roles. Like, I loved him as Thanos. I loved him in No Country for Old Men. I don't like him as Hal Jordan. I didn't like him at all as Cable in Deadpool 2. Uh, I guess dubstep never dies. I hated that they chose him, especially since he was already being Thanos in the MCU at the exact same time. In the terms of Cable, I thought Kevin Nash was a better choice. And I even thought the old guy from Avatar and Don't Breathe, can't remember his name, was the top choice to be Cable. I think he had the perfect voice and personality to be Cable. And they chose Josh Brolin, and I hated that. And now they're doing a similar thing here. Josh Brolin, one, he's getting there in age. Not gonna lie, just putting that out there. But also, he just doesn't fit the Hal Jordan role. Hal Jordan and Josh Brolin don't mix. They don't mix. And I think there's a plethora of other actors out there that could be a better Hal Jordan than him, especially younger ones. And I think that's another thing they should be looking at too is yes, this is an HBO series. So of course they're going to be spending a lot of money on this instead of this being a Max original series. And they're going to be wanting some more known people in these roles. But I don't think Josh Brolin is the fit here. Now, if Josh Brolin declines, which I hope he does, Matthew McConaughey is a secondary choice. And even Ewan McGregor is another choice to be Hal Jordan. Hello there. Honestly, Ewan McGregor as Hal Jordan really throws me off, but I think I could, s I don't know, I could kind of see it a little bit. I think Matthew McConaughey is probably the best choice out of the three that we have here. Not only does he have a detective s background with being in the True Detective show with season one, but he's just a really good actor. He has a lot more range than Josh Brolin, for example, and I think he would be a pretty good Hal Jordan. So I really hope Josh Brolin declines and Matthew McConaughey accepts. Now, granted, I'm kind of not a fan of the three options, period, but if I had to rank it, Matthew McConaughey would be my number one choice, Ewan McGregor would be number two, Josh Josh Brolin would be number three. I think they should choose a younger actor or at least someone that's a little bit, not as big as these guys, but just a little bit under their tier. You know, like Glenn Powell, for example. I think Glenn Powell would be a pretty decent Hal Jordan, if I'm being completely honest. So I actually think Nathan Fillion should be Hal Jordan over anyone else too. Like Nathan Fillion being his guy Gardner, I think is funny, but I think he's the best choice for Hal Jordan, especially if you're going for someone older. And he's voiced Hal Jordan in the DC animated universe, in, in tons of DC animated content. He's a better fit than Josh Brolin. But yeah, I'm kind of conflicted here about the news of our DCU, Hal Jordan. But what do you guys think? I think this will be better than Ryan Reynolds' version of Hal Jordan, just period. But let me know in the comments below who you would like to see play as Hal Jordan in the DCU and who you think would be a good fit for Jon Stewart as well, since Jon Stewart's gonna be trained by Hal Jordan in this show. I'm Captain Zeus, and I'll catch you guys later. See you.